If you're looking to add a little character to your home, why not make a stop at Vintage Market Days in Bixby? That's where we find two news reporter Patricia Santos this morning. Are you looking for some treasures, Patricia? I have already found several treasures. Look at this. Who doesn't need a giant D? Why? Just because. Uh, let me show you over here. We have a giant cotton candy uh, sign as well. How about some old milk bottles? Yep. This will look really cute in your kitchen. I mean, this is just all kinds of different unique things that you can find. I mean, one of these would look good in my uh, kitchen. Why not, right? Mm -hmm. Amy Scott, the organizer of this event, already, this is the first year you've had a big turnout. We have over 3,000 people shown up on Friday and Saturday, and we're really looking forward to seeing a lot more today. Uh, talk to folks. Maybe you, we can't show everything that we have here. Talk about the unique ideas that you can bring from here. Okay. Do we know what this is? I have no idea. The head of a tractor. And one of my friends earlier said this would be great as a pot rack in a kitchen. And the little cotton candy sign, you could just, as one item in a home, just for a conversation piece, just to add character and charm, hang it up in your kitchen. And um, there's all kinds of, I just love like the little school bus over there and just signs and old doors. People love to use old doors now as chalkboards. And there's so many items out here that you just reuse and repurpose and upcycle. Um, it's been fun to see what people are doing. And uh, how many vendors do you have out here? We have over 70 vendors and just all kinds of different characters. I mean, they have all taken um, different items and done something unique. Okay. And, and you know, a lot of this stuff looks like junk, but to somebody, it is going to become a treasure. Absolutely. Yes. And, and you know, like I said earlier, I think if everyone can take something and make it something different, and that's the thing, you get to be creative with Pinterest. People are getting on and looking at items and finding new ways to use them that they would have never thought of themselves. All right. Very good. We'll send it back to you, Erin. All right. Thank you, Patricia. I wish I had the room in my house. All those things look great. Here is the information.